Welcome to my Let's Play for Daker's Quest. Hmm. The Big Night. Daker's PBS debut. Uh, public broadcasting, huh? Encouraging note for our performers. Don't be nervous. It'll completely destroy your performance. On your entire career, and even your dog will be ashamed to look at you. Good luck. Hmm. Oh, I can't pull the curtain. My name is John Dacre. Mm-hmm. For it is risen today. Hallelujah. Sons of men and angels say hallelujah. Your voice in triumph's He was playing too fast. I can't remember the words. Ah, uh, I guess I better go get a paper bag to cover up his face. He's been absolutely destroyed on the stage here. Uh, just got off the stage, man. Before they start throwing the tomatoes, you need to go. Before they get out a big comical hook and yank you off the stage. No, you're supposed to lead through stage left out the back door, not go down the aisle. They'll murder you. John Dacre was disgraced. This dream of becoming the greatest ever public TV singer, crushed by Reva and her atrocious accompaniment. His one chance to fulfill his dream. Vanquished by Riva Unsicker. Ugh, what a day. It's a new day. A fresh chance for Don Dacre to reclaim the victory from Riva. Riva, maybe? I don't know. But how? Good question. Perhaps someone in town can help me regain my confidence, so I can take this paper bag off my face. Or at least the paper bag I should be wearing. So like a reverse Shia LaBeouf. I'm not famous. Um, I was messing around this game before, and I got stuck on the um rhythm game. So when I get through it, will be about, what, half the game maybe? Reva bested me, Lumberjack Joe. I'm a defeated dejector Daker. You need victory. You need to train like a champion. You should check out the Coliseum in town. I don't know why there's a Coliseum in town, much less why there's a rhythm dance game there, but whatever. Hello, Johnny Deary. What troubles you? I failed on public TV. I need to find a way to redeem myself. Well, that's a simple one, Johnny. You'll need it to increase your confidence, work on your enunciation, and train yourself like a champion if you want victory. More confidence, better enunciation, train like a champion. That's it, huh? Yes, exactly. Do that in that order. Okay, thanks, old lady. You're welcome, dearie. Hmm. What do you want me to do about it? Go potty, Mr. Tubbs. Go potty. Wow. Such such great humor there. Whatever. What? We're just hanging out until the club opens up. Welcome to the Coliseum. Why is there a Coliseum in town? You won't understand. We're here to build strength. To take a puny man and turn him into a regular man. Take a regular man and make him into a champion. Are you a champion? Well, I... Uh... We are the champions. Come back when you're ready to be a champion, too. Until then, find something else to do. Yeah, there's a barrel there. Show up this morning. Don't worry. You're our best man working on it now. Hmm... 
Maybe if we try to move it a little to the left. No, no, that'll never work. Seems an impossible task, but it's my charge, my burden to bear. I will find a way. I must find a way! I must find a way. What the? Is that? Oh, it's a, it's not a bird or a butterfly. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's a teleporter, so I'm just sending you back to the very start of the map. No, not really. Ouch. This scene hurts. Sister, are you okay? I'm praying. Oh, sorry. Praying for an earthquake or a tornado, perhaps a sudden fever or maybe a stroke. Anything that would get me out of here. Hush, dear. Uh, I'm not sure why I'm still here. How much longer can this go on? He's amazing. This was an enormous mistake. I'm busy. Well, butter my biscuit, it's John Daker. Sit down, enjoy the show. This song made an international sensation. Wow, you certainly seem to have a lot of confidence for a guy who, um, for a guy who can sing like an angel and polish off a bucket of deep fried chicken in under 15 minutes. Why wouldn't I be confident? I'm amazing. Hey, you, you're disrupting the concert. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to, I never intended to. Be confident, John. Don't let him talk to you like that. You're the one only John Daker. Show him what you got. You're right. I'm John Daker. I'm John Daker! Time for you to go, John Daker. Honestly, I think this would have made a better joke if it was the head of Usher attacking us, you know? Plus, you can use it as a reminder to um, Kanye Quest 3030. A game where you have to beat up a whole bunch of rappers in their heads. And where Kanye is probably the worst character in the game. 69. Ooh. That just sounds nasty. You win this time. Daker. Great job, John Daker. With your comments back, you'll actually be able to sing. Sing with confidence, eh? Choir. Using singing and ballad will damage all enemies, but keep an eye on your music points. Speaking of singing, I've got a concert to finish. You'll pay for that humiliation. You must now face the power of the Usher Trio! They use a cloning machine, you know, created by... Darn it. Urkel. There you go. I know you used to clone Bruce Lee's. You're no match for me, ushers. What items? Eh, interesting choice of defense command, but let's finish this and move on. Very well. Your skills could not be denied. You might even be able to challenge that singer who's always at the club. Good luck, Daker. Usher's away! I swear that sound effect sounds familiar, I just can't place it. Hmm. What? That don't count because I did it on purpose. Because it gets me a bit closer to the end, somewhat, maybe. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Probably a good idea at the time. Uh. But we're gonna have to sing if we want to earn our way at this place. Okay. Oh. Splendid. I'll show you to your room. Hmm. 
Okay, now we got full MP and health back. We're ready to go to the club. I hope you enjoyed your stay. Please leave. I mean that in the most insulting way possible, because I'm French. That's how French people are, you know, they insult you to your face by telling you nicely to leave. But I mean the complete opposite. Don't cause any trouble or you'll have to deal with us. Hey bro, go find your own table. This club is amazing! Uh, please make him stop. Can't take much more. What can I do? Challenge Almudo to a sing-off. Can you just pass out? Oh, Grandpa, you're fine. I tried. <laughs> and the next day, and all next week, and the next month. I get it, thanks. Hello, Giant Harry. You found your confidence, I see. Uh, yes, I did. That's nice. Now it's time to work on your enunciation if you want to take on Reva. How should I do that? Why try asking that nice young man on stage for advice? Really? If you want to advance the plot? Yes. Right, God. Thanks again, old lady. You're welcome, dearie. For have a good reason for interrupting my performance. I challenge you to, uh, um, not entirely sure, but I know I'm supposed to challenge you to something. Fool, you can't possibly win. Gotta love the clashing art styles here as far as the Emmys go, right? And how does this background have anything to do with the club we were just in? Um, but you're just gonna sing your way to victory. Wow, I just must have missed. Shoot. Hopefully I don't get confused again. Got him. You're very good. Although, you might feel better if you just forgot about the words every now and then. Forget about the words? On purpose? You mean you intentionally ignore the words you're supposed to be singing? All the time. I haven't sung any actual lyrics all night. Feels great. Give it a try. I don't know. Trust me. <laughs> New sync battle skills acquired. Using enunciation and battle will heal you, but keep an eye on your uh, your music points. Or MP for short. You disturbed our guests. Time to face the music, Daker. Bubba, we got another one for you. Now watch me walk over there slowly. Painfully slowly. So fat. Ooh. Show this chum what happens when you don't follow the rules. Mwah! Fat and dumb. And this art clashes with the previous two enemies. I, it's impressive only in how much this game is inconsistent, I guess. Let's enunciate. Okay. Ow, he got faster that time. Ow. Got him. How do you defeat Bubba? Wow, that's not a completely dated joke. Just get out of my way, losers. I'm John Daker. I'm invincible. Until we get to a rhythm game. Then I can't win. I've gotten too many left feet. In fact, I got all left feet. It's, it's pretty horrible. 
Um. Well, I guess we gotta go try and strut our stuff. What the? What happened to him? He moved the barrel, but it was too much for him. For any man, and in the end... He fell. Goodbye, old friend. Find peace in your victory. I know it's meant to be a joke game and random stuff happens in these all the time, but seriously? He died trying to move a barrel? Like, was it a barrel full of snakes or something and they bit him? What's in the barrel? How much does it weigh? Is it made out of that really heavy metal they talk about in Dragon Ball Z that breaks the Z-Sword? How exactly did he die? Is it so heavy his insides basically got pushed off his butt? Yeah, you can actually do that. Follow me if you want to be a champion. I really don't get the point of this, besides being really tedious. I don't care if you're going to put lyric songs to it, this was still a needlessly tedious point of this quest. Whatever. John Dacre, you are a true champion. Here, on Sinker will finally have met her match. She's waiting for you at the public TV station. Go get her. But what does dancing have to do with beating her at her, um, her own game? Hmm. Sorry, I can't talk right now. Ahem. Mm -hmm. <coughs> it's no use. She's been like that for years. Nothing has disturbed her. Gears? Seriously? That's right. Legend has it that she will only rise from her slumber when ancient evil is awoken and challenged by a worthy warrior. It is said. It is said that she'll come to the warrior's aid at a time of great peril, and that great evil will be defeated. Forever. Really? Who said all that? Some guy, I guess. I don't know. Huh? Yeah, we should go. I'm not supposed to talk while I work. Oh, it sent us to a different place this time? Why do I have to buy the house behind this club? The noise, it never stops. Nah, I can't help you. At all. It's about as, about as useful for this as the um, item shop, which I didn't show yet, but I guess we can go there next. Right? Welcome to the item shop. Thank you. Can I see what you have for sale today? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Um, what items are you selling? Selling? I'm not selling anything. What's an item? But isn't this a shop for items? An item shop? It certainly is the item shop. How can I help you? Never mind. Splendid! Okay. 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 Sure or not. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yep. We're gonna nuke these chickens' very minds. It probably still won't be enough. Okay. 
Since these chickens are probably invincible. And now we die. I don't know what the point of having unbeatable chickens is, though. And why make a reference to Zelda anyway? I don't know, this just feels like a random throwaway joke. Ah, oh, great. Reva, thank you for 55 amazing years teaching in this town. Love from your biggest fan, Reva. Oh, is this a hatch? This seal is engraved, it reads, For my beloved Reva, You are mine, I am yours. Two like souls, two kindred spirits, intertwined as a web is woven. We shall revel in the darkness for all eternity. May you sleep like the undead in this gift, crafted just for you. With all my heart, the Dark Lord. Maybe I shouldn't be here. Yikes. Are you crazy? Well, I guess we should go face off against the spawn of the devil. Don't know why. Any other reason why Dark Lord would be interested in her? John, you look different. You seem much stronger than you were. More confident. Are you ready to face Reva? Are you sure? There's no turning back once I let you inside. Alright, then I'll lock the door and let you in. Godspeed, John Daker. Godspeed. Reva. Well, well, if it isn't John Daker, back for another humiliation, I see. Not this time, Reva. I'm ready for anything you've got. We'll just see about that. Take this. How much of my champion level scene can you take? More than that, apparently. Ah, man, these Borgs hurt. Darn it. Good, I faded. And you're defeated! We are victorious! You improved your skill, I see. It doesn't matter. You can't win. You can't win! Final form. How do I look, John? Reva. You cannot win, Daker. I will crush you once and for all. Not so fast. Long have I slumbered awaiting this day. Legends foretold that a hero would rise to vanquish an ancient concealed evil. You, John Daker, are that hero. I have awoken by providence to come to your aid at this very moment of greatest need. Receive my final act, a gift to you.
Foolish girl, it matters not. Don't you understand, John Dacre? I could not be defeated. Give up while you still can. Why have you held this place in your clutches? Riva, it's time for your reign of terror to come to an end. Permanently. Don't be ridiculous, John. You can't possibly expect to win against me now. If I go down, Riva, you're going down with me. Can't be. <sighs> okay, thus Dagger's quest came to an end. Rava Unsticker would never again rule the public TV airwaves. Shangir had won the hearts of the public TV audience. Ratings skyrocketed. Jane Shangir was offered a job as a daytime television talk show host, which he took. Is that guy still passed out? Though he gained his confidence and perfectly honed his abilities, John Decker would never again sing in public. For those of us who remember as true fans, never forget the song of John Dacre. I guess they should be thankful, because honestly, this game is just not very rewarding. <laughs> <laughs> 